To engage or not to engage? That is the question. Hey, I'm Rob Onspach from Onspach Media. And, you know, I had this debate earlier today where I not only got unfriended, but I got blocked. I know. Sad what happens on social media. But I digress. This whole thing came down to, this whole argument came down to, should we engage or not engage with our video streaming audience? So when we go live here on Facebook or YouTube or wherever the video is showing, should we engage with the audience? Should we acknowledge them when they come in to say hi? I'm not one to do so. And the reason why is I want to repurpose my videos to be able to be shown on YouTube or on Facebook or on Twitter or anywhere else I want to put it without having to interrupt every couple paragraphs or whatever I want to say, you know, acknowledging people coming in to my video. Now, some people like to say, hi, Rob, hi, whoever, thanks for joining. But then your video cannot be repurposed without other people kind of going, what the hell is going on? It, it becomes annoying. Now, if your sole purpose is to engage with the audience, and this is going to be one of those videos where it's a once and done thing, great, do it. But if you want to repurpose your videos elsewhere, then acknowledging the people that are coming into your live streaming doesn't make sense at all. So the reason why I share this with you is because there's a lot of philosophies out there. A lot of people, a lot of gurus like to tell you that there's an absolute right and wrong way to do things. No, it's personal preference. Now, like I said, I like to do it without acknowledging my audience because I have a reason behind what I do. Other people say, no, you have to do it this way. I want you, when you're making these videos, to do it the way it feels comfortable for you. Do you want to build immediate engagement with your audience and hope that someone's watching so that you can say hi, welcome, and do so? Or do you want to repurpose the videos to be able to be used elsewhere? And not only just elsewhere, but later in time. I like to make my videos that what I call evergreen so that the content that you're watching now is still relevant in a couple weeks or a couple months or a couple years. And you know, if, if someone's got to be listening to my video and then where it could have been a three minute video, but now it's a six minute video because I've, I've acknowledged everyone who's jumped in, it just doesn't make sense. So to engage or not to engage, that's really up to you. You've listened to me uh, and, and my opinion on what works for me. If you want to learn more about what I do and how I do it and how I help my clients, visit me at onspockmedia.com. You can also go to Amazon and if you type in my name, uh, Rob Onspock or Onspock Media, you'll find some of the books that we've written on social media, on podcasting, and some of the other books that I believe that would help you be a better entrepreneur. Hey, this is Rob Onspock. Talk to you later.